Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode here from the Lionheart Dynasty server. And today, we're going to make our good friend Jackson's dreams come true. Everybody, meet Jackson. Welcome to this video. If this is your first time here and you're looking for ideas and tutorials to help you survive and thrive in Minecraft, start now by subscribing to the channel and clicking that notification bell because I make all sorts of Minecraft related content and I've got you covered. Well, our good friend Jackson here, he was born and raised in the iron foundries. And as he was looking out upon the iron golems following and being processed, he had a dream. A dream of something better with that iron. A dream of shears. Jackson dreamed of becoming a shepherd and working at the loom. And so finally, as we were able to talk with Jackson, we realized we had to do something to help Jackson's dreams become a reality. So guess what, Jackson? We're going to build a sheep farm just for you, buddy. Well, if you've been keeping up with the series, you might remember two episodes back. We built this room here with the staircase that's behind me kind of led to nowhere. Well, we had the idea to use it for a loom room, and so that's exactly what we're going to do. And guys, if you haven't seen that episode, we're going to link that up in the top right now so you can check it out. But yeah, we need a place to set up Jackson, and we need a place to set up his sheep. So let's go ahead and roll a time lapse of us building what's up there now. Wow, guys, doesn't this just look fantastic? Now, there's a lot of work to still do in here. And one of those things is to actually <laughs> finish up this area. Now, what I went ahead and did is planted some ice in there and then put some blocks underneath it so that it could go ahead and grow. Now, what we're going to do is just go ahead and place some kelp all the way to the top, just like this. And we're going to have this beautiful display. It's going to add so much color and dull up the orange a little bit. But it's also going to make it look so wonderful in here. And we've got all of these to do. But it should turn out pretty nicely. Just like that. Anyways, I'm going to finish these up. And the other thing that we have to do, guys, is we really need to bring the sheep in. Uh, I believe we also need the shears as well, but that's where Jackson's going to come in because we'll trade with him and get a bunch of shears. So let's go ahead and look at where the sheep are and let's talk about what we need to do to get the sheep in here. Oh man, the animal sounds are out of this world. But anyways, guys, previously we had built these one by one cramming farms and so what I decided to do is I just place some blocks around this guy here build the blocks at the stone level 
with water. They floated to the surface and then I was able to drive this boat into the corner and bring them up. Now what I can do is simply take my axe, hit F3 and B, break that guy on out of there, make sure we cover that hole so they don't fall in, and then I've got both of these sheep that we can go ahead and take in there. Now this trip's going to take 16, we're going to have to take 8 trips to get 16 of them in there, but that should be pretty fun, and uh, it's worth it for Jackson. I'm going to go ahead and break out these cocoa beans as well. Make sure that we fit with the sheep through there just, just easily. Well guys, we got Jackson up here. We got the sheep farm up and running and we finished off the roof. Now we did this roof off camera. It was pretty simple. Mainly just some trap doors, a couple sea lanterns, and just this little arch made out of stairs and planks. Very, very simple design. Something any of you guys could do. But I wanted to take a second to let you guys see how this farm here worked. Basically, the observers we placed down there read the grass. Now with that uh, sheep grow, regrows its wool by eating. It will be detected by the observer and the shears inside the dispensers will automatically shear it. Now we've put glass inside of the sheep's head and that makes the, the wool pop up. Now occasionally some of it will get stuck like this but it's not going to matter because there's going to be so much wool in the end. Uh, we're not, we're going to have more than we, what we know what to do with. And which means that our uh, our friend Jackson here is going to have all the work he needs. His dreams will have now been fulfilled. Don't you worry, Jackson. We're going to get you a couple co-workers in here. That you guys will have plenty to do and hopefully be enjoying yourselves. Anyways, guys, thanks for joining me in this episode of Lionheart. Oh no, apparently all the sheep drowned in here, that's really? <laughs>